Hi guys! So as you can see, I finally got my Alex's put together. Don't mind the chair. I still have to get a chair, so I'm just using like an extra chair that we had up in the attic. Um, but I got everything put together. I got two Alex drawers from Ikea, and I got a tabletop. So that's what you are looking at. And I'm going to go through, and I'm going to show you guys my makeup, and I'll show you some of the stuff that I just recently got. And I'm not bragging. I know everybody always has to say this in their videos, but this is in no way me bragging. I've had requests for it, and I want to share it with you guys because I like you. I think you guys are pretty awesome. So I'm going to show you what I have. So first up here, let me sit down. Up here on my tabletop, I just have some makeup brushes. I found these little hat boxes at the dollar store. They were like $2. So I just have some face creams in there. And then I have my Maracuja oil by Tarte, my Josie Marin Argan oil, a cuticle oil, and then my macadamia hair products are back there. Uh, some more makeup brushes. I have my um, Makeup Forever foundations that I use every day that I love. I swear by. They're like the greatest thing ever. Hi, guys. Ooh, it looks like I have a belly the way my sweatshirt's sticking out. Gross. Um, more makeup brushes. My little Eiffel Tower lamp um, and a candle. So I'm going to start over here. And just show you guys what I have. And before I start, my nails, my thumbnail's naked, and I was just playing around with nail polish. So please try not to pay attention to my funky nails, because they really are a mess right now. Um, just some random blemish creams and gels. Some blush, some more blush over here. This I just got at Target. These are cream Based, So it's a cream bronzer, a cream blush, and a cream highlighter, and it's by Pacifica. And by the way, my camera's not focusing, so I'm very sorry if things are out of focus when I get close up. I don't know why it's doing that to me, but of course it is. But I'm getting a new camera soon, so that is a good thing. Um, Milani, what is this called? Fantastico Mauve. And then this I just got at Target, Mineral Wear. Um, in the color, I know you guys can't see it, Rosy Glow. So that's by Physicians Formula. And then this was a limited edition by Maybelline. It's in the color Coral Burst. It is like, if you can see, it's like traffic cone orange. It is so bright orange. But it doesn't go on like that. It actually looks really pretty on. Bella Bomba by Benefit. Fox in a Box by Hard Candy. Uh, Smashbox, what color is this? Prism. I kind of use this as a highlighter because it's really light. Um, Flirt, that's from Kohl's. A Jordana. And then these are my palettes that I use a lot. This is Boudoir Eyes by Too Faced. Ah, this is hard to do with one hand, you guys. Uh, the Naked One palette, which I know everybody has seen a million times, but I just got it, so I'm, like, super excited to play with it. Uh, the Natural by Stila. So pretty. And In the Light palette by Stila. Love. I really like Stila eyeshadows. And then this I kept because I wanted to show you guys, and I will show you um, this the little palette here. It's a blush and two eyeshadows, and it comes with a mascara and a lip gloss. Now, the lip gloss I have at work. I left it at work, but these two things I will show you. This is from Sephora, and this was $20. So, if you guys are looking for something high-end and you, you want to get a lot for your money, you really should look at these little kits that they have or these little sets because, I mean, you guys get a blush, Two eyeshadows, a mascara, and a lip gloss for $20. You can't beat it. So just keep an eye on them when you go, if you go into Sephora or Ulta or any of the higher end makeup stores. Because the those sets are a really, really good deal. Down here we have eyeliners, uh, some roll-on like cream um, eyeshadows. And then these are the Maybelline Eye Studio Gel Eyeliners. These are my favorite. But I normally don't do like a crazy eyeline, so I don't use them that much. Um, 
This is an eyeliner palette from Sonia Kashuk. This is from Target, and I just got this. It's not even opened yet. And then over here, these are my Chubby Sticks by NYX. And there's a couple by Rimmel in here, the Scandal Eyes. And then these are just some pigments. Back here, we have some highlighters and translucent powders. This Lorac one, eh. This is hard to do with one hand, really hard. I know I said that already, but it is. Um, I use this as a highlighter, and this is in the color Luminous. And then I have an e.l.f. one in there. Um, this is a translucent powder from Sonia Kashuk. Pixie translucent powder. And then a NARS something or other. What is this? Oh, this is the Santa Fe. This is actually just a regular face powder, but it's, I don't know, it's kind of orange. I really don't use it that much. And then over here we have mascaras, and let me find that one. This is the one that was in that set that I was just talking about from, um, so, what the heck? I can't keep my hands on it. It, like, wants to get away. Sorry, guys. Okay, so here it is. The Lashgasm by Too Faced, and it actually, oh, look, I have makeup all over me. It is a really nice mascara. I've been using it, and I actually really like it. Um, this is the Mega Plush by Maybelline. This is my favorite mascara. Mascara. I can't keep my hands on it. Out of any of the mascaras that I've used, I really, really like that one. Down here we have lip glosses and lipsticks, and I still need to find a better way to store these because I still just have them all jumbled up together. But this one I just got at Target. It's called Sundays on the Same Sign, but it's bright blue, but it doesn't go on blue. It goes on really sheer, and it just gives like a little bit of an iridescent look, but I thought that was really cool. I wanted to show that to you guys. And back here, these are just like chapsticks and what's this? Uh, Fabulips by Bliss. Strawberry Lip Balm by Rosebud. Rosebud Salve. And then just some Vaseline and Baby Lips. Just things like that. Down here is just stuff I use every day. Big and Sexy or what's it called? Big Sexy Hair. Just a hairspray. And then my Estee Lauder serum that I use every day, Idealist, um, Batiste Dry Shampoo. These are my makeup wipes that I use, Evening Soothe by Pons. And then this is the Mega Whip by um, Bedhead. I got this at Marshall's just recently. Haven't really tried it yet, but I hear good things about it. And then just a lotion. That's the Nuance by Salma Hayek. It's like a rose. I love the smell of rose. So anything rose I find, I buy. This is by Josie Marin. This is her um, moisturizing stick. I really wanted a tinted one, but all they have was clear. So I got a clear one. You can use it like on your elbows, your face, your cuticles, pretty much anywhere. And then in here is just some beauty blenders, uh, makeup forever setting spray, some pencil sharpeners, and an eyelash curler. And then down here are some more palettes, the Naked 2 palette, a Pixie palette, um, an e.l.f. palette, and then this, I know it's dark in this corner, I'm really sorry. This is the Theodora palette. Holy crap, it's like sealed forever. Oh, look what I just did. But that's okay because I never use this thing. And I don't know why because it really is pretty, but I never use it. And I just made a mess. Oh, well. And then these are just extras, um, backups of things that I have. Too Faced Beauty Balm and Linen Glow. I actually have two of them. It's my favorite beauty product ever, ever, ever. And I will talk more about it when we get to the other side. Um, brush spray, there's a backup of my Josie Marin Tidden Moisturizer, Josie Marin Argan Oil, Josie Marin Illuminizer. And then a backup of my Makeup Forever um, Foundation and Highbrow by Benefit. So that's that. And then over to the other side. 
Uh, this is just a suntan spray that I got from my mom. So I have to give her that. So I just kind of have it down there. Um, my flat iron. These are my foundations. And we have some Olay BB creams. Uh, what are these down here? Revlon Color Stay Whipped. I have two of those. They're different colors. I kind of mix them together. Uh, Too Faced BB Cream. And then just some basic drugstore ones. Uh, L'Oreal True Match Lumi. I have a couple of those. That's my favorite drugstore brand, I think. Some random makeup brushes and a couple makeup bags. Oh, and some extra um, makeup brushes. In here we have my bronzers. This is Sunny by NYC. Let's see if I can get it open. This is a really nice bronzer. It's like $3, but it's com comparable to Hula by Bronzer. Hula by Bronzer. Yes, that's what it's called. Hula by Benefit. Um, it doesn't have any shimmer. It's just a basic, pretty colored bronzer. It's, it's nice. I like that a lot. Happy Booster by Physicians Formula. Here's a Tarte bronzer that I will use in the summer because it is like super super dark elf body glow and then some more physicians formula just different powders here's one by Rimmel oh and this is pretty I'll show this to you guys uh, this is the flushed palette by Urban Decay so this is a bronzer a highlighter and a blush so this is really nice, like if you're in a hurry and you're just running out the door. And then these are just some face powders. I don't use powder on my face that much because my skin is so, so, so dry. Uh, this is Reserve Your Cabana by Wet n Wild. I use this as a face powder. I know some people use it as a bronzer. I'm olive complected and this works great as a powder. Uh, Mineral Wear Face Powder by Physicians Formula. And then this one is a flower by Drew Barrymore. And then these are tinted moisturizers and illuminizers or highlighters. Sonia Kashuk Illuminizer. That Gal by Benefit. What's Up by Benefit. Uh, Magic Lumi by L'Oreal. And then... Here's a hard candy one and Bonnie Bell. I love me some Bonnie Bell. It's so hard to find. And then the Naked Skin by Urban Decay, Clarins, Mary Kay, and this is my favorite, Josie Marin Tin and Moisturizer. Well, second favorite because the Too Faced Beauty Balm is my favorite, which I'm going to talk about in a minute. We are almost there. In here is all my eyeshadows. These are my kind of bigger eyeshadow palettes, um, quads and things like that. I have a bunch of Wet n Wild ones. I probably have every Wet n Wild one that ever was made. I really like Wet n Wild eyeshadow and it's inexpensive, which makes me happy. Ah, This is the Naked Basics palette. All just matte, basic colors. Good to do a smoky eye. The Runway Palette by NYX. Very pretty. I use that one a lot. Another NYX. Little quad. Revlon. Uh, Flower by Drew Barrymore. Here's a little Clinique one. Let's see if I can get it open. Nope. Not going to happen. Uh, Revlon. And then these are just some bigger Wet n Wild palettes. Ah, my battery's dying. Um, these are Singles, Jordana, mainly Jordana. Here's a little Clinique one, Jessie's Girl. And then in here, these are all my um, color tattoos by Maybelline and my L'Oreal Infallibles. So that's all in here. I have every color tattoo I think that's ever been out. I love, love, love them. My favorite eyeshadow that I've ever used, um, high end or not, is these color tattoos. They're great as an eyeshadow base, and they're great, of course, as an eyeshadow. And then back here, this is my just little brow basket. I have a Sonia Kashuk brow kit. 
I have a Milani one in there, and then a Benefit browsing, and just some little eye, eyebrow little trimmers and things like that. Second drawer is concealers. I'm obviously addicted to concealers. I swear I have every drugstore concealer that has ever been invented because I am seriously a hoarder. Uh, Sonia Kashuk, hidden, I think it's called Hidden Agenda. Yeah, the Hidden Agenda palette. Lemonade by Benefit, Pixie, CoverGirl and Olay, Erase Paste by Benefit. Here's a little NYX eye base. Another NYX white eye base. And then just some random concealers. Rimmel. Here's an Aveeno, like under eye brightener. Ome. Pixie. Neutrogena. I seriously, guys, I have a problem. Will you please, someone, get me into some sort of counseling? Because I seriously need it. These are primers. Professional by Benefit. Uh, NARS eye base. Uh, Photo Ready by Revlon, L'Oreal, Studio Secrets, and then my top drawer. Dun, da, da, da. This is my favorite drawer. Sorry, let me readjust myself because I feel like I'm kind of shaky. Let me readjust. Okay. Uh, All Nighter by Urban Decay. This is their setting spray, which I am obsessed with and I love. If I don't use this, I really do notice a big difference. So this really works. And then this is the beauty product that I would sell my children for. The Too Faced Beauty Balm in the color Linen Glow. I love this stuff so much. I can't even begin to describe how much I love it. I don't know why, but it just makes my skin so amazingly perfect. Not that my skin's perfect, but as close as my skin is going to get to perfect is with this if that made any sense. And then this is NARS, what is this? Oh, Albatross. So yes, that Too Faced Beauty Balm, I seriously, you guys, I love it so much. And then this is um, Orgasm and, what's the other one? Laguna Bronzer. And then just some Olay Face Cream, Chocolate Soleil, Too Faced Bronzer, and then my favorite NYX blush. This is Boho Chic. It's one of their cream blushes. Love it. Oh, this is the Too Faced little palette thingy that I wanted to show you guys. So this is what came in the kit. So it was a blush, two eyeshadows, and then, of course, you guys know I've said it a million times, the mascara and the lip gloss. Really, really good deal. Uh, Tarte. I know you guys can't see it. Clean Slate Flawless. This is their... Um, primer and it's silicone free which I really like so it doesn't have that weird silicone-y feel and then Josie Marin Illuminizer and down here just some random eyeliners and Eye Bright by Benefit, Highbrow by Benefit, Well Rested by Bare Minerals and then same just more junk over here Makeup Forever Translucent Powder Bare Minerals Well Rested um, Concealer Powder, Jordana Eyebrow Kit, Anastasia Eyebrow Powder, Stila um, All Over Shimmer, Posey Tint by Benefit, Pixie uh, Brightening Corrector, uh, what's this? Stila Kitten. That's probably my most used eyeshadow. I use it all the time. I love it. And then these are just like little minis of. What's Up and That Gal by, or Girl Meets Pearl from Benefit. Girl Meets Pearl. It's another, like, illuminizer. I know, my stupid camera. Uh, Lorac Eye Primer. I've been using this a lot lately. I really like that. And then in here is my favorite mascara, Mega Plush. Some little eye cleaner wipe or Q-tip thingies. Uh, Tone Correcting Powder by e.l.f. This is like one of those eh, multicolored ones. I really like it because it doesn't leave that chalky look behind. And then um, an e.l.f. This is similar to the NARS one that I just showed you guys. It's a bronzer and a blush. 
And then High Beam by Benefit, I use that every day. This is my my favorite highlighter. And then a NYX Concealer and Stay Don't Stray by Benefit. So that's it, guys. That is my setup. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video because I really enjoyed showing you everything and I'm so excited about my new vanity. You guys, I have not had a vanity in so, so long. I have been... Hey, guys! I have been just... I have had makeup spread out on our spare bed forever, so this is like a long time coming. So I'm not bragging. I'm just really excited because I really needed this. Thanks, guys, for watching. Ooh, it looks like I have a big belly the way my sweatshirt's sticking out. Oh, my gosh, I'm such a hot mess. But thank you, guys, and don't look at my bedroom because it's such a mess. All right, I will talk to you soon. I'm going to try to get a nail tutorial done now. So thanks, guys. Bye.